Not bad. Yeah, it was pretty good. I'm not going to waste any time with it. What's up, YouTubers? This is The Jester coming to you with another quick gun review on a Bushmaster A3M4 firing the 5.56 cartridge. Now, out of all the uh, guns that fire the 5.56 cartridge, I'd say this is probably one of the most popular. I'm sure most of you are familiar with this platform, um, so we probably won't get into this too in depth. I just want to make it fairly quick. I'll tell you that uh, this particular model here is the, called the A3, this is a Bushmaster A3M4. What makes this the A3M4 is that it has a removable carry handle on it. And uh, I kind of like the removable carry handle option so that, uh, you know, if people talk about if shit hits the fan, if shit hits the fan, well, if it ever did, you don't want to have to worry about, you know, your, your sighting system being broken or not having batteries for it. So I like to have the removable carry handle. It's something that um, is just very dependable. I don't have to worry about that ever breaking. Also, uh, this particular version uh, has the... Um, the collapsible stock it has a, a one in nine twist barrel. It has the forward assist and comes standard with your 30 round clip. We'll do a check real quick. I don't know if you all know what uh, forward assist is, but I'll demonstrate quickly uh, what the forward assist is for. That's when you get dirt in your uh, slide here and it won't close properly and, and chamber your round and you slap the little forward assist here to make sure that it seats the round correctly before you fire. The, the 5.56 cartridge that goes around 3,000 feet per second causes a lot of damage. It's a small round, but uh, it definitely gets the job done. Uh, very little kick, low recoil, just all around and fun gun to shoot. Um, I, you know, I don't have much else to say about it other than I want to go shoot this thing and I think you want to see me shoot it. Let's blow some shit up. Hell yeah, I'll see you out on the range. Now let's see what this beast will do to some metal targets. What was that, a dud or something? Hmm. Maybe I should try that again. Let me try to load another bullet here. I see what's going on here. This isn't my M4 at all. This is my AIR-17. It's actually a BB gun. <laughs> Easy mistake to make. Uh, we're gonna shoot 10 in a row here and see uh, how good we do with the M4. Check out the uh, EOTech there. Yeah, all right, let's do this. shakalaka and that's how we do it now we've had a lot of success with the uh, cool whip containers uh, let's see what we can get out of the 223 cartridge oh yeah there we go that looked pretty good let's try the next one All right, hairspray bomb, take one. Damn. Well, 
This is the first time I've ever tried the Tannerite before, so we're going to start out small and we're going to see how this works. If this uh, works well, we'll, uh, we'll move up a notch and try to do something a little bigger. Tannerite experiment, take one. All right, this is experiment two of Tannerite. We're gonna step it up a notch. Let's see what this bad chicken will do. Fire in the hole! Ooh, goes the dynamite! Woo! Fire in the hole! Well, if at first you do not succeed, try, try again. Fire no! And boom goes the Tannerite. Trademark pending.